to the whole my followers and subscribers out there. I'm not doing a review of any movie or musical at the moment. You don't know last year I said I was taking a break from all of those, but I'm still doing it. This is, I'm gonna be really quick. I'm gonna be really quick as I can with this video. I was trying not to make it sad video, but if you guys know, I posted a video of my dog Pookie playing in some fresh grass, and you saw her when I was doing a Ratatouille monologue in my behind me, right? Well, I'm going to say this. This is going to hurt me, and I don't feel too happy. But today, I had to let Pookie go this evening. She passed away at 5.40 this evening. And just this morning, she wouldn't take her meds. She stayed out in a grass bed. And just before I left for my classes and then came back, she remained under my parents' bed. She wouldn't come out. I knew my parents believed there was something wrong with her. So I had my aunt, Annie and Uncle Derek come over to get her out of the bed and once I got her on the leash and pulled her out. I had them take her to the vet while I was being interviewed. Then I heard from my mom that what she heard from the vet. That Pookie's going through a lot right now. And I don't think they can help her. I was in the vet. I just got home from the vet. They brought her in. She was still walking around, but she didn't want to eat anything. Especially the treats my Uncle Derek had for her. And I had my sister and my parents FaceTime me. I was so bummed that I watched them put her to sleep. When I got me before all this. I heard she would I wasn't taking I'm not taking this very well as I heard about it. And I watched him put the needle as I watched him put the needle in her I knew her time was I was told it was her time to go. Now, she's gone. I remember going to Miss Pookie. She was the first dog I ever had. She did turn 15 this Monday. Apparently, what she was going through wasn't very good for her age. I remember having Pookie since she was a puppy. I remember getting her and she was the very first dog I ever had we ever had that brought my family and us closer. I, mean, I really loved my dog. She 
brought me joy and happiness. She made me laugh whenever she did something funny. She would get very excited when I would take her on walks and when it's time to feed her breakfast and dinner, she never had lunch. She would come up to us wagging her tail, telling us to feed her. And now I'm sad it's over. Pookie was my part of my life and my happiness. She was the most special dog to me. I'm glad that my parents did their best for her while I was on my mission. had some days that were good and some not so good. She would always say baths. And I would always spend time to cuddle and give her whatever she was laying around from the window on the floor. And yes, I gave her one last kiss and hug when she died, when she was put to sleep. I'm sorry. I just feel like this had to be told and gotten out of the way. But yeah, please. If any of you are LDS or just pray for me that something happy will happen. And thank you guys for taking the time to hear this story. Please like, subscribe, please rate, comments. Wish me all the best of luck with my life and my dream of pursuing music or theater. And I say, I really miss you, Pookie. I love you. You are such a sweet dog. You will be missed. And I will always love you as I always have.